Ladies and gentlemen, you want to see what great postal service looks like? This came in in a package that said fragile on it. You ready? I'm really excited to see what this was supposed to be. <laughs> I mean, given it was in an envelope, so I wasn't exactly like surprised that it had broken in transit, but it's one of the things that we're opening up today. And today's a very interesting day because it is completely, and I mean completely, going to be based off of a soul box that I have been sent. And uh, I'm really not sure what to expect from it, but I'm very excited. But before we do that, let's go ahead and bust this bad boy open. Now, I figured out that these letters that I got sent actually came along with uh, read off cam. This one came along with this picture. So I read this last time, but thank you for all your content. I've been around since 250K subs on the main channel. Congrats on 5 million, you deserve it. Help me and so many other people. I lost my older, uh, my binder of Pokemon cards, pain, but I have a base set to original, I had base set originals on first edition. So I have no Pokemon to give you, but I drew this for you. Hope you enjoy, I know you will. From Dennis, YouTube and Xbox Gamertag, Wolf's Rayet. Thank you so much, man. I am sorry that your picture sounds like this, but we're gonna do our best to open it up and also if this is glass on the inside not cut ourselves <laughs> because that's what it's it sounds like there is literally completely shattered glass on the inside of this so i really don't want to get ah! i really don't want to get smacked by this but we'll see all right so here we go oh yeah that's a picture frame uh-huh that's that's part of the picture frame Maybe the art will be saved. Oh, yeah. <gasps> the art? Aha! The art is mostly intact. Oh, gosh. That really is not working with my camera light. Here, let me turn it. Look how beautiful that is, dude. That's actually so sick. The art is pretty much intact. That is absolutely so sick. That is, I, I mean, if you drew that, that is unbelievable. That's so cool. I love the I love the like monochrome and then the the purple eye. That is so cool. Thank you, man. Holy crap! Really, really appreciate it. Yeah, there was nothing. Ah! Ah! Yeah, that that is straight shattered ice. Uh, sh shattered ice. Shattered glass in there. So we're gonna go ahead and not mess around with that too much. I would try to pull it out to show you. It is just literally straight up shattered glass. But the important part did survive. We got the picture. I appreciate it so much, man. Sorry that happened. Now, um, we have something very, very interesting to uh, to show you guys here. Now, let me go ahead and... Ugh, actually, let me just... Ugh, okay. There we go. This is what we're opening up today. Now, it's a entirely full pack of sealed product. Now, I, I, I'm assuming it's going to be really awkward if it's the wrong person. But um, someone sent me this. I'll read the note here in a second. But someone sent me this and uh, basically emailed me saying, hey, if I like sponsor a video and send you a bunch of packs to open for a video, will you do a shout out for my channel and leave the link in the description? I said, sure. So here we are. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at what the letter says before we get started. Uh, and it's going to be a real variety day because there's a ton of stuff in there. Oh, I thought my hand was bleeding for a second. Packs and polls. Hey, no one in the Pokemon community. Hope you like my care package. I really appreciate the sponsorship opportunity. Hope you find some awesome stuff in here and hopefully you get some awesome polls. My website, packs and polls, and there, uh, .com, and you'll be able to find some amazing sealed Pokemon products along with a small variety of Yu Gi Oh! and sports card packs. The first 10 orders get a free hidden pack of Hidden Fates at their order. You can keep up with my Instagram. I hope you guys uh, can go check out the site, but not before watching the vid. And make sure you like and subscribe. On a personal note, no wait, thanks for giving me such, uh, having such a great personality and consistently giving people the good vibes and laughs we all need. Good luck on the packs kind regards justin instagram packs and polls twitter packs and polls appreciate it so much man you're an absolute legend for that one i really really appreciate you and uh excited to see what we actually managed to pull out of here i'm just gonna go ahead it's really hard to show this on this camera because this camera is like so confined to just like a small area i'm just gonna pull literally the top thing every single time and we're gonna open it we're just gonna do that until the entire box is done so uh, let's go ahead and start off here with some battle styles. Thank you again to Pax and Pulls for, uh, for sending me this, this, uh, huge, huge box of just a ton of random stuff. There's like some st sealed stuff at the bottom. I, I literally have no clue what we're going to be opening up today, aside from what I can literally see, uh, like sitting on the top, which is 
given not very much. So it's battle styles. Hey, listen, listen. We we we, we I'm not gonna lie. Yesterday got yesterday got pretty bad with battle styles, but it's all mental, right? You gotta keep in mind everything is mental. So as long see, look at that positive mental attitude. The next thing on top was Vivid Voltage, one of my favorite sets ever. You see, you see what a little bit of positive mental and a little bit of ignoring battle styles even exist can go a long, long way. So here we go. Battles or not battle styles. Woo! No, Vivid Voltage. Matang, Drefrig, Alistair, Jameko, Blitzel, Slugma, Beldum, Milseri, Duat, and a Shriftry. Let's go. Or Shift Shiftry. It's such a hard Pokemon to pronounce for some reason. We got another Vivid Voltage uh, single booster. Let's go. These things do have a little bit higher chance of getting something good because they are sold individually and therefore are priced a little bit higher. But I, I said this before, the reason that they do this is so if you, like, you're not a Pokemon addict like me, you just want to buy a single pack, boom, you open a single pack, boom, you get a rainbow, and all of a sudden you're interested in Pokemon, and then you'll buy the big boy packs. So, what did I effing tell you? What did I, mm, I really wish it was the rainbow one. I really, really wish it was the rainbow one, but a Chonkachu to literally start off the day on this, I told you that they do that, man. On the very second pack, a Pikachu Chonkachu. Let's go. It's a VMAX. I need the rainbow one. Okay, next up is another Vivid Voltage. I need the rainbow one so bad. So bad that I I would literally trade both. I would trade my Flapple and my Pikachu VMAX in 10 times over for a chance at the rainbow one, man. I, I need this rainbow one. So incredibly bad. Also, this is like real up in my space. You're in my opening up space box. There we go. Much better. Go goat. Hey, look, it's me. It's the go goat. Except the go goat never gets any pulls. Chatot, Joltik, Heroes Metal, and a Terrakian. All right. We got battle styles. Okay. Listen. If you if you pretend like the bad man doesn't exist, if you just close your eyes, it, the bad man doesn't exist. Okay. Here we go. Dude, the sad part is I still have, like, three more booster boxes of battle styles, and I just, like, ugh. Ugh, I want to finish the master set so bad so I can never look at it again. Sometimes I wish I sometimes I wish I was just way luckier in every other set except Hidden Fates so that I could go back and, and open up more Hidden Fates, but I have the master set for it. I can't justify the prices Hidden Fates cost to go back and open it, man. I really can't. Because Hidden Face is just so expensive, but it's such a fun... It's literally my favorite set of all time in, in the current era. Hidden Face and Team Rocket, those are my two favorite from, like, Vintage and then the current era. I mean, it's not even the, it's not even technically sword, sword and Shield, but you know what I mean. Whalmer, Rock Ruff, and a Xerneas Hollow. Very cool. Just, just caught a bunch of him in Pokemon Go. Next up, we have a little uh, smaller product here. It's a two pack booster of battle or is this three? Oh, it's three three pack booster of battle styles yep and then you get a little uh bonus coin and a bonus eevee yay so cute so cute there we go code boys i'll throw you a bone for this episode you know saying i never did anything for you all right we got three three packs of battle styles you know Again, if you close, okay, this is just, this is just, un... okay, that, right, it right, it is. it's a slash redeem, I saw it. Pain, timber, timber goes literally the entire tree forest that fell to supply these absolute trash cards to the universe. Gosh, battle, st oh, I love the arts and battle styles, but the actual act of opening it is so bad. Hey, hey. Think of the Pikachu. Think of the Pikachu. Positive mental attitude, and boom. See, see, you see, you see what happens. You put a little bit of positive mental into it. You pull a Vmax. That's all it is. All right, here we go. One more. No shot. We pull like a Tyranitar or something out of here, right? Absolutely no shot that we pull a Tyranitar. Let's see. I mean, honestly, honestly, I don't even want the Tyranitar. I want some of the cards I don't have yet. That's what I want. Ball toy, Mr. Mime, Fermentus, Spiro. Cheryl, Innocent, Scorch. Okay. 
Next up, what do you know? It's another battle styles. <laughs> let me go ahead. I see the next one as well. Let's let, let, let's let's get down to something else. <laughs> I see the I see the battle styles. They, they they aren't very good at hiding. That that little that little or Shifu on the top of everything. It makes it real real easy to spot the battle styles. Yamper, like a tongue. Zubat, Remoraid, Onyx, Weeping Bell, and a Primate. Here we go again. Oh, time right. Hey, this is a little boosted luck though. I'm gonna guess the energy on this one. We're gonna go. We're gonna go anything but anything but psychic. Anything but psychic. Here we go. Boom. Easy. Easy clap. A little bit of boosted luck here. Hero, Escape Root, Tepig, Hone Edge, Electabuzz. Gligar, Dublade, and a, eh, I mean, like I said, a little bit of boosted luck. We got a single strike Urshifu V. Okay. I mean, it exists. It exists, right? That, that, that's about all you can say about that. I mean, the Pikachu, the, I'm, I'm very, I'm very stoked about the Pikachu. And speaking of, we've got another Vivid Voltage here on top. Okay. We've got some real interesting products coming up now. I, I don't I don't think I've ever seen that product. Oh, this is gonna be sick. Wait, I this is this is gonna be sick up next here. Okay, okay. I think we have one more thing in between. Oh, okay. And then we get down into the, even the cooler stuff, the more sealed stuff. It has like bubble wrap around it. I'm real excited to see what comes out of those. Mumu cheese and an executor. All right, we have yeah. Okay, we just need to get get rid of these. And we'll be, we'll be down to the goods. We'll be down to the goods. And double pull. Flawlessly executed. And here we go. We're not even gonna do the card trick on these. I'm so, I'm so done with battle styles. We're not even gonna get, do the card trick. There you go, Code Boys. You're welcome. We're just gonna, we're just gonna get through them. We're just gonna power. Battle styles, more like see ya styles. Boom. See. You know, you don't even miss anything. You don't even miss anything. All right, throw that. All right, here we go. Here's the big guns. What is this, bro? This is a Mega Tyranitar, like, pen with two booster packs of Sun and Moon and Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion. Both of which I've opened up a fair amount of, but never, like, in an actual opening, like, a full-on opening. So a lot of these cards are going to be new for me. This Mega Tyranitar pin is really cool, though. Look at this. Bro, that's so dope. Mega Tyranitar is such a cool design. Such a cool design. Let me put that over here. And let's go ahead. We, we got to do Sun and Moon first, and then we'll go to Crimson Invasion. Incineroar. Does Incineroar have any cool alternate art cards? I feel like... Wait. Oh. Oh. Okay, well, so we got something good. We got something good. I was like, where's the code card? It's inside of the pack. So that, if I could do that every single time on purpose, I swear. Metapod, Dupider, Lolan Meowth, Growlithe, oops, Rock and Roll, Cosmog, Palosand, and a Polyrath Hollow. There's that, there's that code card coming into effect. Polyrath Hollow. Let's see if we can do it again. Hopefully this time a little bit higher rarity too. Here we go. Cacnea on front. And... Fighting, Gastrodon, Peking Red Card, Sinsinko, Cacnea, Swinub, Mankey, Aeron, Corfish, Devoured Field, and an Oranguru. Why is that such a weird looking Oranguru? <laughs> that is a strange looking boy right there. Okay, very cool. We've got a little something here. What is this? <gasps> oh, it's the Victini I need. Wait, is this the Victini I need from Battle Styles? Okay. I want to save this. I want to save this because individual cards that would actually help me out with my master set are literally the things that I'm most hyped for out of all the possibilities. Oh my gosh, we got a Shining Fates 10 here. Let's go. I'm, I'm going to save that till the end because if that is the Victini V, I need... Not Battle Styles. Is it Battle Styles? I can't remember. Um, Dude, let's go. We got ourselves a sealed... Let's see. Let's see if it's a U.S. or a U.K. Uh, U.S. or a U.K. purchased box. We got the Eldegoss there. Take that out later. 
We got one, two, three, four, five, six, baby. Let's go. That's a US base 10. We get the maximum value over here. The UK ones, they only have five tens or five packs in the uh, Shining Fates. <laughs> it's so sad. It really is so sad. All right, we can show the code cards for this because it doesn't spoil. One, two, three. Oh, my. Oh, I swear on. Okay, thank goodness. That's not the reverse hall slot. I was about to say. Because that card is in terrible condition. It got, like, squished when it was in the 10. It was just poor printing by Pokemon, man. Shootle. Eevee. Here comes the really bad card. Boss. Okay, thank goodness. It's boss's orders. And an Arctazolt. Arctazolt. I don't think I need an Arctazolt for my master set of Shining Fates. I'm almost certain that I don't. Arctazolt. Yeah, we already got that boy. We already got that boy. We will take it, though. That's a reverse hollow shiny. Or, uh, sorry, a hollow shiny. Not reverse. Nothing about that is reverse. Where's the... Hello? There we go. All right, here we go. We got a Snom. Snom is good luck. Dude, people... What happened in the printing of this Pokemon? What ha... That is the... Dude, this is the worst tin of... of uh, that I've ever seen Pokemon produce. Of uh, Shining Fates. Usually Pokemon's pretty good with Shining Fates, but this one is this one's pretty bad. There's there's like some errors and stuff on here. Thank goodness it was just on a Manaphy, but wow. All right, hopefully the hopefully the rest of these are good. Pokemon, I knew ba I knew Battle Styles had a lot of misprints, but I, this is the first time I've seen Shining Fates look this ugly. All right, this one's perfect though. We're good. Okay, we're gonna reverse the back two because we need all of those reverse Hollow slots. Gym Trainer, Team Yell Tau, Floatzel, Roulette, Morpico, Spinarak, Snom, Grookey, Manaphy, and when you finally get a pull, it is in perfect condition, baby. The Evetal, amazing rare. Let's go, baby. Dude, you know what I would actually love, speaking of Evetal, is a, a Xerneas amazing rare. Why does a Xerneas amazing rare not exist? Because if Evetal gets one, like, Xerneas definitely deserves one, man. Hondo P. Xerneas deserves one. Like, no shot. Here we go. Fire, Rusted Sword, Gym Trainer, Thwacky, Yanmama, Coughing, Morpico, Horsey, Spinarak, Boss's Orders. It... We got a Draco Zolt and an Arctazolt in the end. <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> what in the world? I've never seen that before. We got an Arco Arctazolt and a Draco Zolt. We're getting the whole family. Now all we need is a fossil, <laughs> and we'll we'll have we'll have the whole uh, the whole evolutionary line going on here. Okay, there's four. Reverse these two. That's really that's really weird, huh? I didn't need either of them. I need a Duraludon. I used to hate Duraludon until I needed a Duraludon, and now all I want is a Duraludon. And of course, I'm getting Arctazolt, Dracozolt out the wazoo, but no Dur Duraludons. We, we've already pulled ourselves an assortment of uh, of cards here today. So this is good. There we go. Reverse those. We got Electric, Cramorant, Rusted Shield, Dartrix, Roulette, Morpico, Nicket, Eevee, Gossifleur, Celebi, and Adrena. All right. All right. All in all, pretty good. An amazing rare and two hollow shinies. We've got... Uh, let's get... The, we have another single of Vivid Voltage before we get into something that says Open Me. Which is kind of pog. I do I do like I do like the sound of that. Okay. And four. Here we go. Come on, Vivid Voltage. Just you know what would be so poggers if you just randomly dropped a rainbow card on me, right? Just something that I need for my master set or a Zarude Sandstorm. That's fine too. Boop. Okay. Single pack. I believe that's all the single packs there are. Uh we have up next. An open me 10, which is hidden fates. This is a hidden fates 10. Uh-huh. Ooh, mama. Okay. Okay, let's get rid of the promo card. Let's throw the 10 over here. Okay. So we have burnt two burning shadows and evolutions and a shining legends. Okay. These are very expensive packs. These have a possibility of having the rainbow Zard in them. This has obviously that like XY Evolutions base set looking Charizard. And Shining Legends is just one of the greatest sets of all time. So here we go. Okay. 
Okay, if we... Dude. <laughs> Everyone's gonna call rigged. Everyone's gonna call rigged if I pull the Charizard here, but I literally won't care. I literally won't care because I will have the Charizard. It's the rarest card to get, man. It is the rarest card to get, like, possibly ever. Right on. I do love the set, though. Look at that Charmeleon, dude. Okay. Nice card flip, Noah. Wimpod. Meowth. Magikarp. Croagunk. Pikachu. I'm feeling good. Oh, Rhyperior. Rhyperior. Very good card. Not the one we were looking for, though. All right. Let's save the other Burning Shadows to last. Let's do an Evolutions pack. This one is an XY series, which means we do three card card trick. Um, oh, shoot. That's all right. We can still get a reverse holo Charizard. Reverse holo Charizard is almost as good as the original. Magmar. Surfing Pikachu. A little uh, little secret rare there. Love that. Growlithe. Nidoran. Tangela. And a Beedrill. Fortunately, nothing there. XY series is always good. I, I got to save Shining Legends for last, man. There's so many good Shining Legends cards. So many good ones. All right. Here we go. This is a treat, man. This is a treat right now. I, I honestly had no idea what, what he was going to send me when he sent it to me. But this is this is paying off right here. Sock, Mudbray, Oddish, Duskull, Wimpod, and an Alolan Muck. Dude, I got real, real excited when I saw that hollow around the corner for a second. And Alolan Muck. Absolutely disgusting. All right, let's save this for last with the uh, with the individual cards that he sent. I want to save that for last because it's such a treat. All right, and last but not least, I'm just going to go full cam because there's no way this fits. We have ourselves, can anyone guess it? A Shining Fates. <clears throat> Pikachu. Can you? I'm going to tear it open anyway. Pikachu V-Box. AKA some promo Pika Pikas, a big boy Pika, and four packs. So, let me go ahead and get the four packs out. Because that's what we're here for. We know what the promo looks like. We have opened this up a, a time or two in our day. All right. We got four packs of Shining Fates. Once these are opened, we're going into the individual cards, and then we're opening up a Shining Legends pack. Dude, I, I bought the Shining Legends, like my one of my first booster boxes I bought of, uh, oh, that would have been bad if I didn't switch my camera back. One of my first booster boxes I bought of Pokemon cards was, or it was an, it was an ETB. Okay, little Drizzile there, love that. Um, was Shining Legends, and I was so, so like unappreciative of how good of a set that was at the time. I literally did not know what I was opening up it was unbelievable. It was, I, I mean, I bought it because I thought the cards were cool. Uh, I, when I was looking at the set list or whatever. But I had no clue. No clue how much that was that set was actually going to end up be, like A, being worth. And how good the cards actually are in that set. But I somehow managed to pull the Test Tube Mewtwo out of there. It was one of my first good pulls ever. Crobat V and a Spinner Rack. So... I mean, that, 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 that is the luckiest. I think my luck in Pokemon has just like, you know, I don't think I'll ever reach that level ever again. Because, dude, to, to open up as many as I did, which was like two ETBs, two Elite Trainer Box, like 20 packs of Shining Fates, or sorry, uh, Shining Legends, and to pull that Mewtwo is just unbelievably lucky. It's literally the best, best card in the pack, and I managed to do it that fast. So do I, and, all right, I'm, I'm expecting big things out of here because we've, we've had absolute duds so far. I'm expecting big things out of this one. Come on, baby. All right, we're going to reverse the reverse hollow in the hollow slot. So, we, so if we get a reverse hollow or a Charizard or something, it's in the last card. More Pico, coughing, Gossifleur, Cagnia, Cinderace VMAX. Okay, I mean, that's all right. I'll take that. It's definitely one of the better V Maxes in this uh, in this set. Okay, so I guess now it's time for the individual cards. I I can't tell if that's the Victini I need. Is it the is it Unified Minds that I need the Victini? I can't remember which set I need a Victini V for. Full art. It's really bothering me. I guess we're gonna find out literally any moment now though. 
Open before packs. Oh, I was supposed to open that before the packs. LOL. My bad. My bad. All right, here we go. Here we go. Woo! What in the... Is that it? That's it? That's the ba battle styles of Victini V. Why does... Dude, that does not look at all what I thought it was going to look like. That is way cooler looking than I thought it was going to be. Okay, Big Teeny V, easy peasy. Thank you so much, dude. He didn't tell me he was going to be sending some of these. A Galarian Linoon from Shining Fates. Oh my gosh. Bro, I'm, this is making me so happy right now. Literally, the weight of my heart is just sending me individuals that I need. A Colossal. Did I pull this one? I think I pulled this one before he sent it. Yeah, I, I pulled this one before he sent it, unfortunately. But... Still pretty pog, uh, hollow colossal, and an Alistair full art, which unfortunately I think I pulled. It's in vivid voltage. I need eleven more for vivid. These sets are so close to completing for me. I think I pulled this one. Yeah, I did pull this one as well, unfortunately. But still very very pog. Two cards I needed. I mean, Alistair is literally my favorite like male trainer. Um, card. So yeah. That, those are absolutely huge. And last but not least, the pack of Shining Legends. The stuff of Legends. This is where this is where I could literally just be the happiest lad on the face of planet Earth. Here you go. Here's the code. Happiest lad on the face of planet Earth if I somehow manage to pull any sort of Mewtwo card from this. Here we go. Psychic. Dang it. Floatzel. Electrode. Carnivine. Plusle. Weasel, Totodile, Torkoal, Pikachu, Double Colorless Energy, and a... I promised. I promised that the next time I pulled Keldeo, I would tear it up. I have to keep my promise. I have to keep my promise. Thank goodness it did it before I pulled a rainbow one. But either way, ladies and gentlemen, there it is. Plenty of absolute bangers to go through here today. Uh, a lot of fun opening up. I really, really like this kind of like variety thing. So if you guys enjoyed this, uh, like real, real variety, uh, I guess go through of cards where we really just open up some of everything. Let me know. Obviously there were some very expensive packs in there. We didn't, we didn't pull anything good, unfortunately from them, but it's, it's always fun having that rush of opening them up. So let me know if y'all enjoyed this. If you did leave a like subscribe and we'll see y'all in the next one. Make sure y'all check out his, uh, his stuff down below in the description. Peace.